One of the men charged with torturing and killing five deer in Wapaka County now faces more serious charges. He's 25-year-old Rory Kinsey, and charges filed this afternoon accuse him of being drunk when the vehicle he was driving struck and killed a man five years ago. Fox 11's Laura Smith has new details from Wapaka County. After waiting for half a decade, Kevin McCoy's friends are relieved to see justice beginning to unfold. I'm happy that this is finally happening. It's been five years. Um, it was extremely overwhelming. The 20-year-old was killed walking home from a party in the town of Farmington in Wapaka County. At the time, Rory Kinsey was a suspect, but he told investigators he thought he hit a deer. No charges were ever filed because, according to authorities, mistakes were made during the investigation. The Department of Justice reopened the investigation and on Wednesday filed charges against Kinsey in Wapaka County Court. According to the criminal complaint, Kinsey left an underage drinking party the night of October 23, 2004. Witnesses say he was drunk. Court documents say Kinsey hit McCoy with his truck while McCoy was walking along the road. Investigators say McCoy died immediately and Kinsey, with help from another person who had just left the same party in another vehicle, carried his body off the road. Walter Engel, who was a passenger in Kinsey's truck, is also named in the complaint. He has been charged with perjury for allegedly making false statements while under oath. According to the Wapaka County Sheriff's Department, Kevin McCoy's parents are pleased with the charges but too emotional to discuss the case. An attorney for McCoy's family says he's happy the state finally stepped in. There was a lot of frustration with the Sheriff's Department and the District Attorney's Office in Wapaka. The charges were brought originally. Neither the Sheriff's Department nor the District Attorney had any further comment on the case. Kinsey's attorney in the deer killing case says he doesn't know yet if he's on the new case and so he had no comment. McCoy's friends say it's been hard missing McCoy and that they will continue to show their support in court. I just thank God it's finally happening. In Wapaka County, Laura Smith, Fox 11 News. Rory Kinsey will appear in Wapaka County Court on the 10th of December along with Walter Engel. Kinsey remains in custody, and if convicted on the new charges, he faces up to 65 years in prison.